much for clicking on my channel with all smiles over here. I am Will Sanja. It's like asking a question. Will Sanja help you keep a smile for today? And hopefully the answer is yes, you guys. I'm going to try not to keep it long. But y'all already know if it gets good, I'm going to keep on talking. The golden nugget today is this battle isn't yours. Slash let God be your relaxer. Y'all know that song by Yolanda Adams. The battle is not yours. It's the Lord's. Yes, it's God's. Y'all over there about to take your earrings out, and about to take your cap off, and about to put that Vaseline on, put the tennis shoes on, and about to wear. Put up your deuce, and God is saying, no, this isn't your fight. This is for me. I'm supposed to straighten this out for you. Y'all see my hair. Y'all y'all see. Y'all remember how my edges were looking a few days ago? I could barely put a comb through my hair, period, okay? And no matter what I did, no matter how much I tried to wear, roll it up at night, my edges were still crazy, right? But it wasn't until I was able to wear, relax it. And when I relaxed it, look how, look how, look how that perm straightened out. Look, look at them edges. Get, get a close, get a close up. You, Look, I can, y'all, look, I can comb my hair with a thin comb now. That's because the relaxer would straighten it out. And that's what God wants to do for you. He want to straighten that thing out for you. You got to let God be your perm, be your relaxer, be your ex-curl, be your jerry-curl. I don't know what kind of thing you got going on with your hair, but I know God can straighten out any situation in your life, which means what? This battle that you're in, it's not yours. It's not worth it. You opening your mouth to try to rebuttal. Don't say a word. Zip it up. Zip it up. Let God handle that thing for you because it's his, his battle. It is. What does the song say by Yolanda Adams? Hold your head up high and don't you cry. It's a Lord's. Yes. And then it says what? No matter what mm -hmm, you're going through, what's God's doing? God is only using you for his what? For his glory. So that that you're in, God is going to straighten it out like a perm, like a relaxer, like an ex-girl. And then what? When it's all said and done, people will know that there was nobody but who? Nobody but God that did that thing for you. So listen, put your things in order. As far as what? Getting and staying aligned and connected. Which means what? God is at the forefront of your life. Moving in and through you that you're able to see within your journal with some clarity. And that clarity, clarity will let you know that what? This isn't your fight. You're not supposed to say anything back. I know what they said. I know what they did. I know what you said. And I know what you did. And guess what? God's saying that this isn't your fight. It's not your battle. He wants to be your relaxer. He wants to strain it out. Because guess what? When he strain it out. When he fight this battle for you, guess what? It's said and done. It's over and you ain't going to return back to that mess anymore. They ain't going to come to you no more with that again. They ain't going to try to do anything to you again. Why? Because God's going to what? Settle that thing. He's going to make it plain that you are not to be bothered with. Because what? You and him are aligned and connected. Are y'all getting this thing? So listen, this battle isn't yours. It's not yours. No matter what mm -hmm, you're going through, how it goes. God is only using you. This battle is not yours. It's the Lord's. Yes, it's God. So just give it to him, y'all. Put your earrings back on. Fellas, put your cap back on. Put your dress shoes back on. Put those tennis shoes up. And put that Vaseline down, okay? All right, I hope y'all got it, but if y'all didn't get it, rewind this thing and watch again. In the meantime, in between time, if you take just a little bit of what I'm telling you and apply to your life, just, did I just get, did I just get, yes, I did. Let me say it again. Look, if you didn't get this thing, rewind it and watch again. In the meantime, in between time, if you take just a little bit of what I'm telling you and apply to your life to the best of your ability, you won't ever, ever. Ever, 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 ever have to mask a smile. Why? Because your smiles will always be genuine. I'll talk to y'all soon. Be blessed, stay blessed, be blessed, stay blessed, be blessed, stay blessed. Let me give y'all a quick more look. Quick more little look at them edges. Y'all, I gotta look at it. I know I'm supposed to be looking at y'all with an eyeball, but I, let me look at the edges again. Look, 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 look at that scalp. Y'all know I couldn't see. I looked like I had on a wig, y'all. Go back and look. At the last few golden necks, you couldn't even see a part. It just looked like I had a wig on. You couldn't even see that. Look, look at that. That's how God wants. He wants to relax your situation. <laughs> Let God, maybe that's a golden nugget. Let God relax your situation. Let him be the relaxer. This battle isn't yours, y'all. I'm going to go because I started talking and I, and I keep looking at these edges. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I did a good job. Yeah, I did.
to my twin sister, what you got to say now, girl? You was talking bad about them edges, but look at them. <laughs> oh, look at Oh, edges. Edges on where? Where edges on? Edges on fleek. Edges on fleek. Edges. 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 Edges on. Edges on fleek. All right, I'm going to go. Love y'all. Y'all be blessed. Talk to y'all soon. Y'all know what's coming next. Ciao.